A local councillor and former police officer has raised concerns policing levels in Townsville suburbs will suffer as a result of the Kelty review. Gary Eddiehausen believes a crackdown on overtime could force officers to be redirected from the suburbs to patrol the drink safe precinct. Councillor Gary Eddiehausen was in the Queensland Police Service for nearly four decades. He's also a vocal supporter of the city's drink safe precinct. I'm aware that just for a fraction over $531,000 was um, given to the drink safe precinct trial uh, extension. But I've since found out that, that all that uh, money is being diverted towards uh, the Anglicare, uh, street chaplains. He's concerned none of that funding was directed to police overtime, which could be slashed under the Kelty Review. When overtime for police, especially in relation to Flinders Street East, was either reduced or cut, that required officers in charge of various stations and sections right throughout the city to provide policing from both the uniform and plain clothes. We've actually increased the police officers in Townsville by 18 police officers. Uh, the Kilty review is in relation to uh, the speed cameras on the sides of the road. Mr Eddiehausen wants a commitment from the state government that policing levels won't be affected in suburban areas where juvenile crime is rife. Shadow Police Minister Bill Byrne says the government should continue to adequately fund the Drink Safe Precinct initiative but not at the expense of core operations such as patrols in the suburbs. There will be uh, the no fear in relation to uh, any reduction in resources to drink safe precincts in Townsville. Jessica Howe, 7 News.